Gangnam Style. Gangnam Style. Op, 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 Gangnam Style. Season 3, Episode 9, because we had to have a Spike episode. Q&A session coming up at the end of this uh, season of commentaries. Please continue to send in your support and questions, and we will have them at the end of this season. What's well, not that many? How are you supposed to read twelve books in one weekend? Princess Celestia uh, you can do it. Like Hannah, she would never have assigned them to me. I'm not planning on letting her down. Well, I hope you're not planning on sleeping then either. Actually, Spike, why don't you take the day off? Really? Why not? These books are going to keep me busy for a while. Hmm. Yeah, Spike gets a day off. To it's going to be the end of the world today. Touch nose with tongue. Why is she walking Applejack's dog? On my belly. Done. Smell my dirty feet. <sighs> Done. Well, that was a short that list. Nearly as long as I thought it would. Yeah. Really. My little pony, my little pony. La 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 la, my little pony, my little pony, dead 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 dony, my little pony, my little pony, all 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 the bronies. Big adventure, tons of fun, a beautiful heart, faithful and strong, sharing kindness, it's an easy feat, and magic makes love complete to have fun. La 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 la, the the ponies, ponies, the bronies. What what what? What up? Yeah, okay, whatever. Alright, so he has nothing to do now. His imagination will kill us all. Kill us all! Kill us all! Kill us all! Oh no! Wait! Run away, balloon! You know what they say about, about idle dragons, right? They cause trouble. Now, Granny Smith, you're in the way again. And into the ever free forest. Constant. If I didn't know better, I would swear that I was in the middle of the dark and scary ever free forest. That's what I just said. What was that? Come on, Spike. Just because this forest is full of wild, dangerous animals, doesn't mean that you're going to see one. <laughs> and there's a timber wolf. Surprisingly, made of twigs and timber. I guess they're magic. Aren't you supposed to be doing a job somewhere? It's kind of like, uh, I don't know, Cowboy Texas Ranger pony style. Time she says, "Don't mention it. Don't mention it." Saw the balloon floating by with no pony in it. Came out here to investigate. 
guess you Weren't you supposed to be doing a uh, job, though? Yeah. Seriously. Investigating the runaway hot air balloon, too. So, uh, now that the mystery's been solved, let's get out of here, huh? Yeah, let's get out of here. Let's carry a balloon that can carry us by our bag, because obviously we're that heavy. But now I have some chores that need tending to, so see you later. What chores? I'll do them. That's sweet, but you don't it's have... It's the least I can do. You saved my life. I need to repay the favor. Shoot, Spack. That's what friends do for each other. You don't need to repay the favor. Yes, I do. Sugar, it's okay. It's not necessary. Applejack, you don't understand. This is something that I really need to do. Well, I hate to get in the way of doing something you need to do. Great. What should I do? Uh, Apple. How about sit there and look pretty? I was gonna lend her a hook, but maybe you could lend her one instead. On the double. She don't. He don't have a hoof. I could help you. Great. I could use all the help I can get. <laughs> Wait till Applejack sees how you sparkle. Yeah, well, Let's she go. sparkles. Applejack, is it okay if I get going? I don't want to be late for my crusaders meeting. We're getting fitted for water skis. <laughs> you definitely don't want to be late for that. Water skiing, shooting marks, here I come. Spike, you can <coughs> too. How about <coughs> we try one, one so thing even constantly oh, instead of a lot of things once? Please, Applejack, you must allow me to assist you further. I don't know, Spike. Just don't feel right to have you uh, doing things for me. Please? Really? You don't? Pretty please? It's just not necessary. Pretty, pretty, pretty please? Yeah, what are you doing, calling her oh, pretty? Oh, right. You can help Granny Smith and me bake some pies! Pies! I'm helping Applejack make some pies! Yes, you're so excited. Uh, Spike, little feller, could you get us some more eggs? Huh? Coming right up. Might be a while on that one. Uh, Yeah, but what in dough? Well, water and flour makes dough, so... Brr, it mops stuck to the ceiling. Your help today, Sugar Cube, but I can take it from here. His name is not Sugar Cube! It is Spike! Today's just the beginning. What's that now? Spike! According to the Spike the Dragon Code, I owe you a life debt. And you drew that yourself, right? she need your help and such? Huh, right. I better break the news to Twilight. I just hope she doesn't take it too hard. Be right back. Uh, I think we'll take it harder. Come on, Spike. This is your personal, moral, ethical dragon code we're talking about. You have to do this. It's not like you and Twilight won't be friends anymore. But it cough, cough. <laughs> it has to be done. Twilight, Applejack just saved my life from horrible dragon-eating timber wolves. Mm-hmm. And, as you are aware, I adhere to my dragon code, and this means I must serve her for the rest of my natural-born days. I'm sure you understand. Mm-hmm. She's enthralled in a burk. She can't understand what you're saying. Sounds good. Heck, she's got Aloysius. It was okay. Really? So, with Twilight's blessing, I'm free to follow my code and serve you until... Well, until... He just wrecked the house that quick. Listen, Sugar Cube. I completely respect your dragon code. Truly, I do, but I just can't cotton with you permanently serving me. Please, Applejack. My dragon code is a part of me. No, it's not. It's Myself. a piece of paper in your mouth. Let me do this. I don't <coughs> dragon anymore. <coughs> Can't have you feeling like you're not a noble dragon now, can I? Great! Then from here on in... Yeah, I'll guilt trips will get you everywhere. Oh, uh, okay. I would like you to... Hmm. Oh. Huh? Help me take some of the pie, you 
been made to Rarity? Uh, sure, why not? Yeah, sure. I help bake it. It looks so delicious. Smile, your own TV. For all the world to see. You even look good when you're chewing. Yeah, okay, whatever. Aren't you going to have some more? I had a big lunch. It's 10 in the morning. Breakfast? A big breakfast? Oh, okay. Maybe you could take her plate back to the kitchen and wash it off. <coughs> As you wish. What's that all about? Uh, I saved Spike from some timber wolves in the Everfree Forest, and now he thinks he has to serve me forever. Oh, what oh, I wouldn't give that some pony forever in my debt. I'd get him to organize my closets and give me pedicures and help me with my sewing. And okay, I get it. Having some pony to do things for you would be a dream come true. But I don't feel right having Spike thinking he owes me something. When you tasted that pie, sometimes his help isn't that helpful. Do you have a broom I could borrow? Oh, there it is. Hey, Jay, Rarity, what's happening? Applejack saved Spike's life and now he has to serve her forever. Sweet. What are you having him do? Wash your laundry? Clean your room? Help you with your unfinished novel? Mine's about this awesome Pegasus who's the best flyer ever. You have a novel? You're writing that something. Geniusly woven, intricate plot line. Just came to me. Thing is, I don't really want him to yeah, stop. Yeah, okay. But I don't know how to get him to stop. That's easy. Just make him help you with something really, really hard. I don't know. I don't want him to get hurt. Please. He'll quit way before there's even a chance of getting hurt. No, he won't. Leave this to me. So, Spike. Applejack was going to help me stack some hay so I could practice smashing through it. But I'm feeling extra, extra powerful today. You are? Yeah, I am. So instead of hay, I'm going to smash through rocks. Rocks? Yeah, a huge tower of rocks. And Why is she always smashing yeah. things? Yeah, I mean, unless you don't want to help Applejack. Why does she I always have to smash? Then get to it. How many times have we rebuilt uh, AJ's uh, barn? I'm thinking it might have been about what five, eight times by now. I'd have just pretended I didn't have anything for him to do. Why didn't I think of that? Is this high enough? That's plenty high. Come on down, Spike. Bad news? He actually ended up building the whole rock tower. Good news? I've got a rock tower to knock down. Yeah. yeah. Open your it. big mouth. Awesome. Yeah, sure it was. This is why she gets hurt so much. Rainbow Dash needs any more of your help. My help. She doesn't need it. Right, Rainbow Dash? Yeah. I guess I'm good. For now. And so am I. I just can't think of one more thing I need help with. So, you don't have to do anything else. What do you mean you can't think of anything else I can help with? Exactly that. There's nothing else. I don't want you to do anything. If I don't help you, how will I know I'm a noble dragon? Well, uh... Maybe there's things you need help with that you don't even realize you need help with. If she yeah, how about, how about breathing? Maybe not. Maybe Applejack needs help realizing what she needs help with. Like, maybe your back is just... Uh, that does feel good. <laughs> See? Or you might need help remembering your favorite song. Dragon is the finest creature ever. There's more to it. That is not her favorite song, I bet. I don't think that's her favorite song. Or, yeah, you know. Breathing? Breathing? I certainly do not. See? There are plenty of things I can help you with. And you don't even have to trouble yourself with thinking of them. No, I'll think of them. Let me think of them. As you wish. Yeah, exactly. Twilight. 
Twilight How does Twilight, Twilight put up Twilight. with him? How did that do it for? No, it's okay. I need to take a break anyway. What's going on? I know Spock told you that he was going to follow his dragon code and serve me forever for saving him from the Timberwolves and that you were okay with it, but... Wait, what? He said he told you all about it. I'm guessing maybe you were a little distracted when he told you. Yeah, uh, probably. I should have realized you wouldn't have let him go so easily. Well, now that you know what's going on, maybe you could talk some sense into him. Oh, Applejack, I wish I could, but this is dragon code we're talking about. Surely you know how important the dragon code is to a dragon. I sure am starting to. Yeah. There's only one other way Spike is Shoot fire! Why do we have a 70, fireplace 70, upstairs? 73, 4, 5. All right, y'all. Here's the deal. Spike needs to save my life. And you want to shoot you out of a cannon towards a hornet's nest and get like a butterfly nest so we can catch you a mere second before we hit the nest and are stung by a thousand angry hornets. I'll wear this mustache. Ha <laughs> ha, wow. The mustache joke. Again. Can I still wear the mustache? <laughs> Why do you want to wear the mustache? When I give the signal, Pinkie Pie and Rarity will come running out of the woods, being pursued by the Timberwolf. I'll start to run too, but then pretend to get my hoof stuck. I'll ask Spike to help me dislodge it, and he will, and I'll be able to get away from the terrifying Timberwolf. Having saved me from certain doom, Spike will then consider us even. Everybody get it? Uh huh. Pretty much. I'll do my best. Mm -hmm. Just one question. Yes? No. <sighs> yeah, I'd give it away. Indeed. Some serious work. Now first, you must lift your foreleg up to your forehead, like so. Applejack! No time. Here he comes. Uh, over here, Spike. You should get yes, he's here. over here, yes, now, Spike. I was you could maybe uh, sweep up all those leaves for a compost pile, and but of course. Oh, by the way. There are exactly 24,567,837 blades of grass at Sweet Apple Acres. I can't believe you counted every single one of them. And you asked me to. And as a noble dragon and follower of my dragon code, I... Run away! Oh, it's very convincing. We are dead. Yeah, <laughs> you're so believable. Jesus. <laughs> oh no! I see this is brilliantly believable. Nice! The real ones come when they hear you roaring! Ah, yay! Uh -oh. 
It's magic. Super Timber Wolf! Yay! I'm really stuck. No more messing around. It's taking wood from all in the forest. What's up with this? This is just not right. There is something definitely not right about this. This is the king of the tingle, uh, timber wolves. Would you just forget your dragon coat already and go? No! I have to save you! Hey, you swallowed it? Really? Let's get out of here! This thing has a stomach? He said, hold on a minute. Wait a minute. I'll eat you in a minute. Just hold on. Uh, I guess not. What happened to you guys back there? Thought you were right behind us. My hook was stuck, and that timber wolf was coming right at me. Wait, you were actually stuck? Uh huh. But Spike picked up a pebble and rocketed that thing right at the huge timber wolf's mouth and saved my life. Uh, yep. It was nothing. It was yeah, it really wasn't nothing. I, I mean, it really was nothing. It really was nothing. In the first place. Yeah. What was that all about? <sighs> I know this code thing's important to you, but if something like this comes up in the future, think maybe we can go back to my code, say that's what friends do, and leave it at that. I sure, why not? Any less noble. Sounds good to me. But maybe let's just try to avoid situations where one of us actually needs the other one to save their life. You got yourself. You know, that's just not possible. Just hey, not Spike. possible. Happy to help. Don't know what I'd do without you. No, really. I'm really, really, really happy to help you. <laughs> oh. Yay, mushy moment. Alright, y'all, keep sending in those QA questions. And I'll get to them. <laughs>